Hey guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 2 of Tropical Rouge Pretty Care. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm, my lips are super hot. Uh. Mm. 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 Just need to find three more. <laughs> like a genie in the bottle. <laughs> well, Laura, it's nice. I want to buy all this merch so <laughs> bad. <laughs> but I might have to wait until my birthday. Yes and no. <laughs> oh, Mana, you're so sweet. Mana, that was a heebie key move, honey. Maybe next month after I do what I gotta do with Bendity. Maybe I'll order the pact. I don't know. Because I really want it. That's probably the... Maybe the biggest thing that I want right now. Until we see, like, whoever the last girl is going to be. And such. Because I know a lot of people want Laura to be a pretty cure. And I honestly want to as well. I think she is really sweet. And I mean, she's already a part of the team. It'll make the most sense. But there's someone else. I just really... Now the girl with the pigtails who is um Nadeshko, Kirby's VA. She should be popping up. I honestly really like the colors of the uniforms. Like, ah. Oh. And it's funny how she's like on the, you know, top left side corner of the classroom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Everybody's like, what the fuck? <laughs> yes. Her voice is really soft, and I love that. Like, oh. So fucking cute. 
cute. Oh my god. I feel like I'm at Ulta Beauty, the anime, and I love it. Damn, Laura, you just say the whole entire time. <laughs> well, I mean, Laura, she made a new friend. She made... It's Kirby. Kirby from Late Back Camp. Oh. Really? Got out and left all on her own? Damn. Oh. How the hell did you get past her parents? Not even her parents. Her parent. Unless she's in the bathroom. We about to have a Mermaid Melody moment. She's in the bathroom. <laughs> Laura. Yeah. Honestly, song goes pretty as hell. We can't have her mom find out about you, silly. God, it's like freaking Kitty Kitty Pretty Hero All Mode again, where I literally downloaded every single episode and I put it on my PlayStation. <laughs> and knowing myself, I'm probably going to do that again. Girl, you probably ain't gonna be going into like the last episode of this series, maybe. Yeah, and it also seems like she procrastinates, like, a lot. I mean, she didn't even want to deal with the crap from last week's episode, and... Oh, that's so pretty! I feel like somebody's gonna redraw that. Oh my god! Uh-huh. Yeah, she can't really do anything. She can help in a way. But, well, I mean... Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
This is really making me want to rewatch Mermaid Melody for like the bazillion time. <laughs> Poor Mana. I mean, yeah, because eventually, you know, when Sango eventually becomes a pretty character, she's going to become Cure Coral. She's going to have to see her, so. Mm. Also, don't draw attention to yourself, please. No, no. You see her hair? Her hair is brown. We we need color hair. Like red and purple and blonde. Yellowish. Hi, Sango. Honestly, the burgers sound good. Mm. Mana! <laughs> Another hibiki thing to do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hmm. But something does tell me, like, at least by the time when we either get to episode 15 or 25 of this show, she's going to be able to grow legs, like, because of the pretty hairs. Yeah. Looks good though. Yeah, sorry. Oh, there's Shango. <laughs> yeah. No one sango. <laughs> Honestly, when Laura pouts like that, she looks like Coco from Mermaid Melody. Oh shit. Oh mana. You dropped it and you didn't even know that you did. Hopefully she finds her in time.
Hmm? <laughs> yeah, but she got bored. I'm a good bored too. She's right, Mana. Two episodes in and these two are already having a fight. Damn. And he's going. It's both of your faults, girls. Jesus. Well, if you would have just stayed at school, you would have found the other one, but no. Oh, but they, what the... <laughs> Uh... Well, damn. That quick, huh? Yeah, but Laura, you can't do anything! The one time I wish she could just skip school. Well, yeah, she needs to find him in order to become queen. I mean, yeah, she can be a little selfish, but she, you know, at least she's not a chocolate or a vanilla from Sugar Sugar Rune. I mean, because, you know, vanilla came a little selfish towards the end of the damn series. Then you have to apologize to her. Yeah, you just gotta find him. You tell him. Mm. Shit. Mm. You know, Mana, you could pop up now if you really wanted to. So I kind of have to say, because I don't think I really talked about more of her transformation. So if I had to choose like where I would put the transformation for just one cure as of right now and not the whole, I think they would go second because Kid Kid a Pretty Girl Mode is still my number one. Um, my close third right as of right now is still Go Princess because Go Princess was... 
every transformation in this damn show is fucking unique. But Go Princess, like, the first time when I saw that show, uh, fucking beautiful and gorgeous and phenomenal. And any other word that I could describe the transformations of Go Princess pretty clear. But this transformation is good as hell. Something also tells me Sango possibly followed Amimana. Who knows? I mean, maybe. Like, oof. No, you were still here the whole entire time? Or Kirby? Oh, Laura. Oh, hun. <laughs> they so cute and I'm so freaking happy that they actually had them officially fight I mean the last like well yeah Hinata and Nantanan they kind of fought and then of course Nadoka and Rabidin they fought but if we're talking about like two pretty cures that fought that would be Star Twinkle pretty cure with um Hikaru and Lala yeah, my, one of my least favorite, not not Lala, but one of my least favorite cures is in that show. I think we all know who that is, if you know me. If you don't, <laughs> just, you know, go watch that last episode of Star Twinkle Pretty Gary. You, you, you'll see who I'm talking about. But going into this episode, like I said, I am glad that they had these two argue because they needed to do something to in order to work together i mean it's been one episode since officially mana has been a pretty cure and laura really all she cares about is finding the other three and of course it's going to be a interesting little journey until we find the other three plus the final one whenever she comes but they're gonna fight and it's okay it's gonna happen but yeah it was a interesting little fight sango my kirby i love you so much and i cannot wait to see you next week possibly as cure coral i mean you guys already know i love all these girls so i can't really choose between the four technically also adding laura that makes five and then whoever is going to voice the final cure that's gonna make six i i can't choose like <laughs> every other series i've had a best girl Oh my god, I'm so excited. Dude, cause like, damn, like, oh god. Honestly, really thinking about this, Coral Flamingo, is it Flamingo? Flamingo? Nope, we're gonna, we're gonna look that up. Give me one second. Um, give me one second. No, that is YouTube. This stupid thing. 
No, go. No. Oh my god, phone. R O U. Okay, that's fine. You're already on the tab, so I just need to go. No, that's a picture. Um. Okay. As a. Oh, really? This was written by the person who made Free and ReZero. This gonna be good as fuck. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't know that. But seriously, it, it's only two episodes, and I can see the the writing of both Free and ReZero. I don't know if they did ReZero season two, even though I haven't watched season two of ReZero yet. Um, but especially when Cure Papaya and Cure, yeah, Cure Flamingo come in, because like. Right now, if we're looking like, yes, Ma uh, Mana slash Cure Summer's transformation is currently now the best one. But when we see Coral, Papaya, and Flamingo, that's when we're really going to essentially, like, who has the best transformation out of the four? Because, like, in my opinion, for freaking Healing Good, um, it was between both Grace and um, Chiyu. I, I thought Hina's was okay. And then, you know, best girl, Umi came down as Kira Earth and she was like nah I'm a bad bitch like this is <laughs> like that award goes to me thank you <laughs> and such but I mean honestly like Sango she's adorable I mean to have freaking Nadeshko aka Kirby say you to voice her and to see her a little bit of last week going into this week and officially her getting her feature length episode and officially being once again another magical girl this time she's not going to be a magical girl that dies thank god we're not going magical girl rising project thank you because i cried when she died um i'm happy and i'm really excited i mean everyone who's cast in this and whoever the final cure is um I think they're all doing a really great job, even though we haven't heard everybody yet. But I'm glad that, you know, they have these, like, really big, big, big seiyus because I don't know how it would have been like if we did another, like, another healing good or something where we had to a point where I only knew one person and automatically, because, like, mm, God, let me say it like this, because you know how, like, when healing good started and I was relatively, like, <laughs> a Kira Gray stand because her VA was the only one who I knew out of the three and then and eventually when Umi's VA came in I was like oh no Umi <laughs> Kirith. with these these four I, I can't choose like I said I mean they're all my best girls and I love them so much and like I said also adding Laura because that's freaking Silica from Sora Online <laughs> it's just it's too much I mean this might be a series where in the end they all might be my best girl and honestly that <laughs> that is hilarious i never would have thought that <laughs> it would have took having like four, not even four or five of my favorite saves um in a show together and saying yeah we're gonna make them all magical girls in this and Dee's just gonna love it yeah <laughs> But I'm really glad and I'm happy. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode two of Tropical Rouge Pretty Care. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially next Saturday, Sunday for episode three. Bye, guys.